Hi, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on what part of the world you are in. Let's jump into lives. Let's jump into Kingdoms Reborn. And I jumped in the map just for like 10 or 15 minutes. Just enough to get a feel for the controls. I want to turn the sounds down a little bit more because it was a little bit loud, the ambient sounds. So we can adjust that a little bit more in game. I'm going to go single player, we're going to go new game. We're going to go with the large map. I'm going to, because that's my first time through, I'm going to drop the AI players down to just one. We'll leave difficulty on normal The first playthrough will leave everything else the same. Let's <laughs> Wood Love River. Uh, see what we've got. You drop hippo. <laughs> Otter dig hare. Mountain dig they. Alpaca slam forest. Uh, let's go with alpaca slam forest. Let's generate the world. And let's jump in here. Alright, um, few we strong, few were strong enough to withstand the cold and plague that claimed the earth. Decades have passed since the frost took our lands and our courage and hope have returned with the melting of the ice. It falls to us, we surviving few, to rebuild a flourishing civilization. Uh, okay, so the game is on pause. So WASD gets us a camera control. Mouse, zoom in and out. A Q and E rotates. Choose a starting location. Okay, so we are still on pause. Now, right mouse wheel, if you hold down, you can drag the map around, which I love when games do that. A little bit of gameplay I've seen. You want to be near water or river, and you also want to be near iron and coal, preferably next to each other to start with, like here. So there's a coal deposit here, there's an iron deposit here and then it has a river running through it starting location is normal difficulty actually I think I'm liking this area right here let's see if we can spot our one I don't know if our AI starts the same time we do or if you can spot them on the map before you claim your area. I couldn't find the AI player earlier when I did a little test. So I have a feeling they don't spawn in their area until you spawn into your area. So I don't want to be like, I don't want to start right here and then have the AI player like right next to me. But I don't know if I have a choice because I could not find them earlier. Alright, do we want to start with the coal? So we got coal, we've got iron, we have stone in that one. We're on the river. I actually like this area here, I think. Because we could do some fishing on the coast. Do we want to start with the iron or do we want to start with the coal? Let's start with the coal because it's on the coast and we should be able to get some food. So let's select this for our starting area. Now you can bump up like food and a costume more so you'll lose a little bit more of your money. But you can bump, I'm going to just confirm, I'm just going to go with what they're giving us to start with. So we unlock the bridge to get across the river I'm assuming. 
Now, it wants us to put our town hall down. Now, our starting area, our starting grid is not very large. So I don't want to take out any of the fruit trees. Or as least amount of fruit trees as I can. Yeah, this is going to be a difficult square to start with. If we have enough money, we'll probably buy the iron one right next to us. Do we have enough? It's not going to have enough. All right. Now, ooh, this is going to be... All right, I, made, I gave ourselves a really difficult start, so let's just do it. Let's throw you... Uh, let's rotate our storage south. Let's throw you there. I, I'm going to pause. Well, let me pause it. Will let me pause. Space bars to pause. All right, so we can unlock for $300. We could take wheat seeds, a trading post, or plus one income every year for 20 you own. I think we're going to take the wheat seeds. And do I want to buy the coal mine for 160? Yeah, because we're going to buy the coal mine for the 160. And we're going to take the guidance. People require food to stay alive to build a food processor. Click on the cards. And then we'll learn about the cards here in a minute. Choose a food processing building. Uh, we're still on pause. It wants us to build a food pro uh, producer, which is the wheat farm. But we also have to put in eight houses. We have $1,400. We can, when this is flashing, you can pick a card and you get a new card every, I think it's 150, 160 seconds. So I'm going to take fishing right off the bat. It's going to cost us 80 gold. Um, uh, can I take more than one? Let's take the hunting lodge. Oh, I can. I can. And the fruit gatherer. Let's take all of those. Uh, great job. You bought your first card. Card selections automatically refresh every round. Um, the round timer is shown next to the card stack right there. Two rounds per season. So there are seasons. Uh, Alright, now, I think the first thing we're going to plop down is the, oh, yeah, the fishing lodge. And then everything has to be built on a path. Let's put our first fishing lodge. Uh, let's leave room for houses. I think I'm going to put it up here. So, superb food is... After the process, food processor is built, it'll start producing food. Uh, we're going to go into... Oh, I don't want to gather. Let's go into here. Let's grab a dirt road. Everything has to be connected by road. So let's throw that there. Okay, right click gets rid of that. Uh, first time, token, T O M K E N, hello, thank you for stopping in. R Alarm 75, hey old man, and happy Sunday. Thank you all for stopping in, much appreciated. Yeah, I was gifted this game, and I thought we would just like jump right in this morning. Uh, wants us to gather Mark 10 trees, but I'm going to. Let's gather Mark some trees for cotton. Let's go trees for wood. And I think you just select, yeah, we just select. So let's, we're gonna make, we need room for houses anyway. So let's take those out. Now it wants us to claim another territory. I'm not quite ready to claim a ter another territory because we don't have a lot of money. Because the territory I want is I want the I want the iron ore next, and it's $2,000, so we're not going to go there yet. But let's unpause. We'll go to one speed. Um, so now we have a biome bonus. I thought we took improved farming. We'll take improved farming. 
and uh, so we go pause can I go down to yeah okay so I can go down to just one speed I want to be on one speed at first let's grab we're gonna need some houses we have the bridge case okay, so we do have the houses now again everything is built off of paths now the really green fertile land I think is for farming let's throw one I gotta hold down shift I think we need six or eight houses to start with let's throw another one there can't put one there can I rotate cannot fit any down there so we're gonna have to put a few houses on this side so let's throw one there let's throw one there we'll start with those four and we'll see if we have enough people housed which I gotta figure out okay so it's saying we have population 18 houses spacing zero because then there's four per I think there's four per house so that's only I think 16 I think so I think we need to build one more house let's look at our path let's pull path down towards the water and look, we're going to start a path out this way and then let's throw in at least one more house uh, let's go this way and then let's just throw in path coming out this way for now so they should be gathering trees and let's get ourselves a couple more trees non-fruit trees and then let's see if we can't find ourselves some stone do we have any stone a uh, little bit here. Let's take that out. Alright. Uh, acquired science points by increasing population, upgrading houses, or building libraries. So let's show the tech tree. Oh wow, tech tree is pretty large. Let's scroll all the way to the end. So we have last, so let's go back to the beginning. So the first one is, so we're in the dark age. Then we go to the middle age enlightenment age let's pause a minute while we're looking at this industrial age is the last one all right we could do foreign trade or we could do basic medicine now if it's anything like banished <laughs> we're definitely going to want medicine before trade let's grab the med let's start research on the medicine um let us so we have our coal mine our hunting lodge let's get let's work on our food first let's go back to one speed oh i see some more stone over here let's grab that stone first because they're going to need it and then let's throw in our hunting lodge as close to the edge of the property over here as i can get it Let's come in one or two. Let's throw our hunting lodge here. And then everything needs a path. Oh, wrong one. So let's drag our path. Can we come? Let's drag it straight across. We'll see where it goes. Oh, perfect. So let's throw that like right there. And then we have and we need to get farming going right away. Let's grab our fruit gatherer. Let's throw it over here. Let's rotate it. Let's throw it over here by our hunter. Or do I want to come in a little bit further to capture more trees? Let's throw it. Let's rotate it. Let's throw it here to capture as many trees as we can. Um, coal mine and wheat seeds. 20 population 
housing space is a uh, housing spaces okay so we're catching up on houses we may have to put one or two more in yet so everybody has a house you're going to start gathering our fruit you're going to start cutting oh we have no wood cutter so we're going to have to manually cut wood until we get a forester now farming again I picked a really bad starting location we don't have a lot of room I do want to throw in some storage over here and I want to throw in some storage over here and then let's look at our wheat seeds unlock wheat switch your farms work mode to grow wheat unlocked the farm uh, where did the farm go okay so we do have a farm now uh, I could see where there's fertile soil and there's non fertile soil so I think you just click and drag so let's start a wheat farm area is too big right there so I'll throw a wheat farm in there Are you gathering fish? Oh, you're a coconut tree. There we go. You are gathering 10 per batch. Now we can, for cash, we can upgrade our fishing lodge. So we can add juicier bait for $315. Upgrade improved fishing. I think that's wood. But I could be wrong. Well, I don't know what that little symbol is. And then upgrade a worker slot. I'm not going to upgrade anything quite yet. Now, coal mine. Let's look at our coal mine. And again, it has to be in the mountain. It's going to cost us money to build. Let's bring it over this. Let's actually, let's bring it over th this way a little bit. Let's throw our coal mine down there. Let's grab a path. <laughs> and then we have a card. So let's look at our cards. Forester. We're definitely going to want a forester. And we're we have a hunting lodge already. So let's grab let's grab the forester for 120. I'm going to grab I'm also going to grab a fishing lodge because as soon as we get a trader we're going to start trading fish for coin so we can unlock our next area. So I'm going to grab those two cards. We get another card available to us in 52 seconds. So I'm actually going to throw down another fishing lodge. Now I'm going to try and get it as far away from that one as I can so they're not overlapping. Um, can't. Oh, we're gonna. I'm gonna have a hard time putting this one in so where they don't overlap. Oh, maybe not. I can throw it right here. Can we go up one square? I can. Uh, let's throw another fishing lodge in right there. Nope, wrong one. Let's connect it by the road. Well, uh, let's just go that way. And then our forester, unfortunately, we don't have a lot of room. We, we do not have a trading lodge yet, do we? No, so there's no trading lodge. Now our house is case, okay, so we have 20 of 20. And we have, do we have one more house coming in? We do not. Let's throw one more house down. Uh, let's throw it there and we're out of wood so we're gonna have to manually cut some more trees down so wood only let's take down these guys so it wants to claim a territory and as soon as we get 500 fish it's we're gonna get something I'm not quite sure a couple more seconds we're gonna get another card 
I really want a trader because we definitely have to claim another territory. Oh, we can claim this one and build a bridge across. I actually like that because then we could put our forester over here and we could build a bridge. All right, let's do that. Let's claim that. Um, upgrading a town hall can help you unlock more gameplay elements. Click the town hall to bring up its UI. All right, we'll look at that in a minute. Let's look at our card we have available. Fruit gatherer, mushroom farm, pig ranch, or a quarry. We already have, we have a, I think we already have one. Can I submit, a, I can get a free refresh and see if we can get a, no, that did not unlock us a trader. Let's grab, we only have 472 coin. Can I cancel that? I can. Unlock priority button, which is a star. Click it to switch buildings priority between three states. All right, let's grab the bridge. And let's bridge ourselves across to this territory. And then let's throw our forester over here. Before we throw our forester down, let me grab a path. And then let's throw our forester down. And then once it's built, we'll take a look at it. Okay, so we can cut and plant trees. We can priorities planting fruit trees. Let's do non-fruit trees because we're going to need a lot of wood. Let's cut non-fruit trees and let's cut and plant so that's going to start bringing us in wood let's throw a storage down for wood let's throw it right there all right so we're waiting for our fish and it wants us to upgrade the town hall so let's look at the town hall 500 coins we don't have 500 coins I really want the trader next so we can start. Uh, we're out of wood, so let's cut a few more trees. Let's go trees for wood, so non, oh, non-fruit trees. Let's cut non-fruit trees. Uh, we're gonna expand over this way, so let's cut some non-fruit trees over here until our forester is up and running. So we're getting stone. Okay, those are steel tools. That's what that symbol is. Medicine's going to need to be a priority. Uh, food is okay. We're gathering oranges. We're gathering fish. Our farm plot doesn't seem to be... Okay, it's set to wheat. There is one worker in there. All right. So it's going to take us a little bit to get some wheat in. I might want to put another wheat field down. Let's throw in another wheat field next to this one. Oh, area's too big. There we go. So we'll get a little bit more wheat coming in. I think we're almost ready to go up to two speed. Uh, what are you saying? You don't have a house? Okay so, okay, so we're just waiting for this house to be built. There we go. So now we have population's 21, housing space is 24. I, get, I think I want to build one more house. Can I throw one in here? There are one square short to throw a house in there. Can I throw a house, um, one square short to throw a house in there? I want to save room along the mountain for 
more mines. I might bring our housing down over here. I don't want to put a house near our forester. Let's can I throw one in here? I'm one square short for there. We're one square short for there. That's a farm. Uh, we don't have many appeal, much appeal there. I'm gonna have to come across the river. Oh, 100% appeal. 97% appeal. Let's throw. Let's throw another house in. All right, so we have two cards available. So we have two turns. We don't have a lot of cash. So if I pass on this one, still no. We have an immigration office attracts new immigrants, which will bring more people in. But I don't have a lot of room yet. Let's take the free. Wow. So there's still no. Tavern increases our happiness. Sixty coins. Let's take the. Let's take that. I really want the trading post. How big is the tavern? Of course, it's not going to fit anywhere near where our houses are. Yeah, I really messed us up with this starting area. Let's rotate you. Now you can move buildings later. Let's throw it there, and that's going to capture most of our houses. And we are desperately needing wood. Okay, can I, is there a prioritize button? Speed boost. Okay, so I can't use that. Is there a... there's a demolish, so I cannot say prioritize this build that I know of. Like in Banished, I have a button I could say prioritize this. I guess I don't have that here. Alright, so we are producing fish. We still need to upgrade to Town Hall. Town Hall upgrade costs us 500 coins, which we don't have. I really want the trader. Oh, our second fishing post isn't built yet either because we are out of wood. Alright, we're going to have to grab non-fruit trees. Let's cut, let's go, let's go there. Let's just take all the non-fruit trees out. So non-fruit trees, take them out. Our second wheat farm isn't built because we have no wood. Our forester Let's go some non, let's go non-fruit trees again. Let's take out an area here as well. And then our next forester, we're going to have them focus on. Okay, now we have a fruit gatherer. We have normal. We have meticulous. What's the difference? Efficiency is a hundred percent. Job happiness is seventy percent. Gathering action takes twice as long, but yields 30% more fruit. I guess we'll just leave it on normal. 29 seconds before our next card. Yeah, I really want... Let's zoom out a little bit. So this area is going to be... Eleven $1 hundred dollars. I really want the iron ore. Eleven $1 hundred there. Four hundred there. That's probably going to be our next square when we can bring our housing over here. Because I think I can demolish buildings and I get the whole building back so I think I can move my entire city if I want to. 
We'll have to experiment with that. All right, so let's look at our next card. Let's grab our next card. Mushroom font, still no trading post. Only have 192 coins. Let's take the free rotation. Still no hunt. Oh, I think we're going to let that card sit there. Yeah, we're just going to let that card sit there. I'll wait for the next one to come up. We have population 23, housing space 24. So we're going to need another house. We're out of logs. Let's go up to two speed a little bit. And let's get some of the stuff built that we're waiting on logs. So for now, let's just do it. Let's go non-fruit trees. We're going to need all that wood. Okay, unlock the statistics bureau. Once built, allows you to view your town statistics. Um, how big are you? And can I put you in here? Of course, we're one square short. Can I put you in here? I can. All right, we'll throw you in there. It's going to cost us more wood, I'm assuming. Oh, it was an instant build. Oh, there we go. So it tells us about our resources. Ooh, I like this. It tells us about our buildings, how many workers we have per building, population growth, similar to banished. We definitely want trading. All right, so that's going to be helpful. Your labor count is at zero at Trainman 102's town. <laughs> Every citizen is employed in a building. There is no free labor left to haul and gather resources full time. To increase your labor count, either expel workers from buildings or manually set the labor count from the town hall employment bureau. So that's why we have no wood coming in because we have no free labor. Can we take... We're good on food. Let's take... One, can we take one person out of caravan has arrived? Do you wish to buy any foods you might have? Let's, we can't buy, we can only sell, but we can't buy. I don't want to sell any medicine, I don't want to sell any tools. Um, we don't want to sell any tools. We could probably sell a few oranges. Let's go. We have 78. Let's sell 20. Let's sell some coal. Uh, I don't want to sell any stone. Let's sell that. That's only going to get us 267. But show the tech tree. All right, so we unlocked. So we did basic medicine. Oh, here we go. Foreign trade. Let's do the foreign trade. That'll get us to Trade Center. Okay, so now we can do... Let Yeah, we definitely want to grow our own. I think I'm going to cancel the second... Let's cancel the second wheat farm. And let's throw in... Medicine. Oh, it was a farm. That's fine. Let's throw in medicine. So let's set you to medicinal herbs. Now we're still, we don't have any free labor apparently. Your storage. You're a fruit gatherer. Where's our house we're trying to build? Right there. So that's not built yet either. We need to free up a laborer somewhere. 
uh, buildings. Let's take one out of the fruit gatherer. How do I take one person out of a... Uh, income science buildings. How can I take one person out of a uh, how do I take one person out of a so if I want to drop hunting lodge to one and fishing lodge to one how do I happiness trading income science I thought it, you said it to do it in the statistics bureau can we do it from the town hall no so if I want to take one out of the hunting lodge how do I drop that down to one worker I can't. I don't understand how they're saying I can move people around. Unlock Employment Bureau. Once bit you can gain the ability to manage your job priorities more closely. Alright, so the Employment Bureau is probably what we need to move our people around. Um, how big is it? Again, I'm one square short to do anything there. Can I throw in... Uh, we're going to have to start coming across the river, y'all. I can throw it in here, but that takes room away from a mine. Can you fit up here? No, you're one square short. I can throw you in here. Oh, let's see what that does. Set job priority. Oh, there we go. Let's take the fishing lodge. Let's go down. Oh, can I go down by just one? Oh, so it just sets the priority. It doesn't tell me. I can't switch. Alright, so if we do fishing, so that, I still can't, like, take one person out of a forest or move them to a fruit gatherer. So that still doesn't help me do what I need to do. We have 573 coins. We have plenty of food. Uh, charcoal burner... Burns wood into coal, which provides two times the heat. We, we're, we're gathering coal, so I don't need the charcoal burner. Uh, do we want a mushroom farm? Let's pass on that one. I don't... I think we're just going to pass on these, y'all. We don't want... So we have a, I don't, let's grab another Forester. We'll keep that card handy. Pig Ranch is 60. Let's grab the Pig Ranch. Um, and then I'm, we're going to keep that card handy. So we're going to get into, I'm waiting for this research to get done on trades. So I want it to trading post. Storage is full. All right, so that's a problem. So let's grab some storage. Let's throw some storage there. And let's throw some more storage over here somewhere. We're already winter. I think our stats look pretty good. So Pig Ranch and Forester. We're going to have to start coming over here. Okay, so this guy is definitely getting us some wood. So that's where our wood's coming from. 
I could put a forester next piece of land we buy I'm gonna put another forester but I'm gonna make it just do fruit trees so we're gonna keep this forester in check um, pig ranch uh, let's look at our pig ranch I think oh wow this thing is huge I don't want to take up space where our forester is I don't want to take up space where our forester is because I want him to cut as many trees as I can. We're going to hold off on the pig ranch until we get our next territory. I'm going to wait for our foreign trade to get done before I take the next card. We're in a, we definitely need, definitely need more houses. We're going to have to start bringing houses across the bridge. We're going to have to unlock this small territory next. One of these two small territories we're going to have to unlock next. So I desperately need more houses. So for now, for now let's grab another bridge. And then let's grab a path. Uh, let's bring a path down through here. And then over to there. Let's bring you go let's bring you like straight down to the end of our territory. And then let's grab I know they're kind of far away, but let's grab a couple more houses. Uh let's throw Let's throw a house there and let's throw another house there. That's going to take it's into our tree area, but I have got no choice for now. Did we do the immigrant office to bring more people in? You are a fruit gatherer. You are hunting lodge. We have two cards available. Did we bring in you are statistics, you are employment. I did not put so we're going to need that thing that brings more people into town. And I think I lost my stream. Nope, I'm buffering, but I don't know if I lost my stream or not. I'm going to wait and take this card. I'm going to wait for this foreign trade to finish. There we go. Three against. Oh, here we go. Three against wish to join your city. So let's let's accept them. And it's going to give us something for fru I'm not even going to try and pronounce that. Decrease upkeep by 70%. It consumes 40% less input, uh, plus 20% and plus 15. We're going to grab this one. Um, you can choose to spend science on tech tree or upgrade the trees. Show the upgrade tree. Okay, so this is different than the tech tree. Uh, charcoal burning. We have wheat seeds. Uh, let's look down here. Homeland defense. Ooh. Look, do we want to start going into barracks? Let's start going into defense just in case. People aren't try people are now part of your big family. Would you like to buy a trading post? Yeah, we definitely want the trading post. Um, I don't have enough, so I can't buy that one. But we can put the trading post down now, and that's what I've been waiting for. And I want to try and get it away from our city. Or where can I put it? How big is the trading post? And do I, where can I put it? Oh, you're going to be one square short. Oh, we're going to have to come down here. 
Eventually, I'm going to end up moving that forest as soon as we buy more property. Right, let's throw our trading post over here. Now we have three cards available. We don't have any coin. I'm going to wait for our. I'm going to let these cards sit here. Let's take. Let's open up fishing. Let's throw the passion card in there. So now we're going to get one more fish per batch. All right. So now we have four cards available. We only have 62 coins. I'm going to wait for our trader. And the next card we buy, I'm going to get another fishing lodge. So we're going to do. We're going to use fish for trading. So I'll definitely want. As soon as we have enough coins, I want to get another fishing lodge. All right, so cool. We got herbs coming in. We have wheat coming in. We're good on food. We're a little bit tools. We're going to have to look at tool production soon. So if we look at our tech tree. Basic tools unlocks the tool shop. Switch from researching influence points to basic tools. Yeah, I want the basic tools instead of the influence points. And anything like banished, you don't want to run out of tools. Then you're really screwed. Uh, so we have population 29, housing space is 32. So we're going to want to take another look. As soon as these houses are built, we'll see where we're at. And we're going to want to start upgrading our houses. They take stone. How much stone do we have? We only have 25 stones. So we're going to need another stone mine. Oh, that's a coal mine. We don't have stone. Crap. We're going to have to gather stone. All right. So let's gather stone, and then let's gather more stone. All right, so we're going to have to look at us getting a stone mine. We only have 100 points. That's probably the core, yeah, so we're going to have 140 points, or 140 coin. And we definitely have to start mining some stone. I think after five cards, you get a wild card. So I'm going to let this go and let it turn into a wild card. Well, let's see what happens when the next one pops. And I think. If you don't take it, it turns into a wild card. So I'm going to let that turn into a wild card, I think. I want this trading post to be a priority. Speed. Um, oh, so it boosts the work speed. Okay, so I don't want to mess with that quite yet. Um, storage is going to be a problem again. So let's build a little bit more storage. And let's throw in, let's look at our paths. So let's throw in a path coming down here. And then let's hook this in. Now that's probably a bad idea. Let's not hook that in yet. Let's also throw in a little bit more storage, like right here. I'm going to wait for the 84 seconds and see if that turns into a wild card. Still wants us to upgrade to town hall, and we almost have enough fish to get whatever this is. So I'm gonna let that go to town hall. We need 500 coins. We don't have 500 coins. We will when this trader's built. What is this? Open the overview menu. Okay, so this is gonna show us like fertility and different things. Okay, so we quest complete 500 fish. Cooperative, a reward card, cool. So let's cooperative fishing. 
Every 1% happiness above 60% gives a plus one productive to the fishing lodge. Let's open up this fishing lodge. Town oh, must be, oh, in the town hall. So that has to go into the town hall. So let's throw you into the town hall. 23 seconds, we'll see if that turns into a wild card. Okay, fantastic. We're going to trade here in a minute. We'll look at these in a minute. So this is the overlay. So this shows us... Okay, so it shows us fertility and appeal and different kind of stuff. All right. And then this one is our save and resume and all that. All right. Five seconds. Do, you, do I get a wild card? Okay, if you reach the maximum of five cards queued, five cards in hand, five queued cards will convert to one wild card. Cool. So we have a wild card. Now that wild card is going to let us pick any building. Um, now let's see what we have. So we have... Let's see if we can trade. So now we can actually buy stuff we're out of. Um, we have a ton. Let's sell off some coal. Let's sell... I don't want to sell any tools. Let's sell some oranges. Let's sell off the leather, because we're not doing anything with it yet. Uh, that's going to give us 600 points. Let's grab those. And then there's a cooldown period before you can trade again. But that's going to give us enough to upgrade our town hall. So let's take the upgrade on the town hall. So um, it's going to give... it chooses... Choose another biome bonus, so improved brewing or improved tool making. I'm going to take the tool making because if it's anything like Banished, you run out of two tools, you're screwed. So let's take that. 29 people now call your city home. Choose a rare re reward card. Plus 20% productivity, 40% less input, decrease upkeep. Well, I'm going to take this one. Uh, research your way to the next era, unlock the town hall upgrade. Town, so we can sell food, we can buy wood, or we can snatch, whatever that is. Uh, great, your town hall is now level 2, upgrading town hall, research technology, and upgrading house is a way to progress through the game. Alright, so if we want to upgrade, so stone. Stone mine is our next priority. We have 300 points. Let's grab this. Do we have a quarry? We do. Let's grab the quarry. And I think I can throw the quarry over here. Yeah, and this will definitely start getting a stone. So let's throw you there. Let's build out a path. Oh, it's already connected to a path. Let's give it some storage. All right, so we have a productivity book. I'm going to throw our productivity in. Fishing Lodge. We have one more card. We have 155 coin. Do I have another Fishing Lodge? That costs us 80. I'm going to take the Fishing Lodge. We're going to, because I want to start trading a lot of fish. Now, if I put it here, it's going to overlap a little bit, but I can't go here because we don't own that. Can I put it here on the river? I can. We don't own it. Can I put it? I'm not going to get as much fish there. Okay, I'm going to have to put it here for now. Put it down as far as I can get it. All right, let's throw it there. Let's build a path uh, straight down. And then we'll, we're going to trade the crap out of fish. We're going to keep fishing going. So we're going to need to buy probably this piece of land next, which is $1,100. We are 
Population 29, housing space 36, so I don't need any more houses yet. As soon as we start getting a lot of stone, I'm going to start upgrading houses. So let's upgrade that one. We have 89 stone, so let's upgrade that one. We'll wait for more stone to come in. We have the pig ranch, but I want to wait until we get another territory because it's big. I, d I do want a forest, another forest, or again, I'm just I'm going to hold on to these two cards until we get some more land. I may just let these grow into another wild card. Um, where are we? All right, let's look at another trade. Let's grab, let's sell off some coal. Let's sell off 80 coal. I don't want to touch my medicine or tools. I don't want to touch any food. Let's, well, we can't. Let's sell some fish. That's going to be our main trade. Uh, that's going to give us another 500. Let's take that. I'm not going to try. I'm going to try not to spend any coins so we can unlock this next territory. So once we do, I'm going to buy two more fishing ports so we can trade a ton of fish. So now we're in a holding pattern until I can get 1,200 coin. So we have more stone. So let's look at, so you are level one. Okay, you're done, you're done. Let's give you some stone. And let's give you some stone. We are again running out of storage space. Uh, let's see if we can throw more storage down by this fishing lodge. And we're back into another winter. We have plenty of coal. We have plenty of food. I'm not worried about winter. Tools are going to become a problem if we don't start making some. almost ready to trade again. I'm just going to let these cards build. We have 105 stone. So let's upgrade that one and that one. And then we'll wait for more stone. Yeah, uh, production per season zero. Okay, work done 85. Okay, so as soon as this comes up, we're going to start getting more stone. All right, perfect. I want iron because we want we really want to start making iron tools, but that providence costs too much. So we're going to have to take the one along the coast here next. Then we could put in fishing. We could put in our pig ranch as well. Again, I'm just going to let these build up to another wild card. I'm assuming that's 26, yeah, 26 adults and three children. All right, so we have population house, so we have still have plenty of housing. Happiness, they don't have any luxuries. Can I, well, I can't click on that. Let's look at our statistics. We have nobody farming, we have, yeah, we have nobody farming, we have nobody gathering fruit. 
we need more people. I think we need that immigration office. You are, okay, you're the tavern. Yeah, we definitely, I think we need that immigration office. Uh, we can trade. Uh, I don't want to touch medicine or herbs. I don't have a lot to trade this time. We have to bump up our fish. We definitely have to bump up our fish. I need people. Let's dismiss that. Autosave, of course. Let's dismiss that. Let's look at this card. Uh, steal dollars equal to target player's population times five. I don't want to mess with that yet. want the immigration office. Let's pass. Immigration office. And then let's throw the immigration office down. I think this brings people in. And of course you're going to be one square short. Alright, we're going to have to put the immigration office down over here somewhere. We got a couple houses there. Uh, can we put the immigration. We're going to have to put the immigration office over here. I think this is going to bring more people in. Let's put you there. Uh, research complete. Let's show the upgrade tree or the tech tree. I want the tech tree. So pottery, wood industry, furniture, or beer brewing. Um, the sheep ranch, mushroom log sterilized. Decrease decreases mushroom farms wood consumption by fifty percent. Okay, we don't have a mushroom farm yet. Pottery, let's take the wood, let's research that one. Would I, a stone tool shop card for $140. I'm going to refuse, because I want to save up enough money to buy this territory. Uh, so what can we trade? Let's sell off some stone. I don't want to touch tools. Uh, let's give a little bit more fish. Let's go like 20 fish. Let's sell off the leather. That's going to give us another 400 coins. Let's take the immigrants because we need the people. Consumes 40% less input, 1%. Let's take the motivation card. Now we have, so if we're going to need another house. We almost have enough to buy this territory. Where do I want to throw the motivation? Let's go into here. You're, the, you're a tree. Let's grab our fishing. And can we throw the motivation in there? I can. That's my wild card. All right, so that's going to unlock a building of our choice, which is going to be no more fishing as soon as we buy this territory. And we'll put fishing and we'll put the pig ranch in. All right, so I think this brings people in every turn now, I think. But I'm not 100% sure. So we're going to need another house. We're going to need a little bit more storage. We're encroaching into our forestry range by building houses, but 
I have no choice. Can I stick another house over here? Um, possibly. I gotta build a path. Let's... Oh, I, I do have a path. Let's rotate you. Let's put another house there. You are upgraded. You are upgraded. You take the upgrade with the stone. Um, you take the upgrade with the stone. You, you take the upgrade with the stone. And um, as soon as this is built, we may want to build one more house. Ah, uh, come on. Give me another 200 coins so I can unlock this territory. Don't have a lot to trade. I'm probably going to let this turn into another wild card. And eventually we're going to have to destroy this forester and move it down. What's this guy? A rogue tribal village that might want to join your city. Ooh. So we may get more people just by buying that. We can trade, which may give us enough to buy this Providence. Let's look at that. Let's sell off some oranges. Let's sell off some coal. Let's sell off some fish and some stone. It's going to give us 599. Perfect. I'm going to unlock this territory. I'm going to take my wild card. I'm going to buy another fishing lodge. We're going to throw it. We're going to keep fishing going because that's going to be our main income. So let's throw that there. Let's grab a path. Connect those together. And then let's grab... I'm going to hold off on the Forester yet, I think, because I think I'm going to grab $2,000, $1,500. This one, $468. We're going to go over here next, and I'm going to put another something over here. So these two small territories are what we're going to look at next. All right, so we have a pig ranch and a forester. I'm going to sit on the forester. Let's look at the pig ranch. Um, which is going to encroach on our forester, but we're going to have to end up moving the forester. Let me sit on the pig ranch until we unlock one of these territories over here. 468, 570, probably this one. Alright, so we need to get our population up. We're going to need another house. Um, you take the upgrade. So I think all of our houses are upgraded now that I can with until we start getting our clay up and running. I'm going to let that turn into a wild card. Uh, we can almost trade and I think this is going to bring more people in here in a minute. Immigration office is bought in and brought in an immigration. So that's going to bring in people. Cool. So that's what I want. That's going to bring us people in. And that's going to fill some of the jobs that are not filled. Okay, so cool. So all of our jobs look like they're filled now.
we desperately need another house. Um, 478, can I buy? We can. Let's take that Providence. And now let's throw in the pig ranch and probably a couple more houses. So let's grab the pig ranch. Let's spin it this way. Take it right to the edge of our property. Let's throw you there for now. Let's grab... Oh, I can't build another bridge. I need money. All right, so let's grab our dirt road. Let's bring this guy straight back to here. And now let's throw in some more storage right there. I'm going to let that turn into a wild card. Um, now let's see if we can't throw in couple more houses so let's go one there and let's throw another one there and then we may want to think about another farm so want to keep our food pretty high And then the next wild card, we're going to take another fishing lodge. I can trade. Uh, let's hold off. So you have, you're upgraded, you're upgraded. What do we need now for the next upgrade? We have to get our, our hearth and our fireplace. So we got to get pottery and clay going. Um, requires the middle age before we can upgrade our town hall. All right. We don't have a lot of coin, so we're not going to be able to buy anything once I get my wild card. So let's look at our trade. I can probably start selling off some of our herbs. Let's go with 80. Let's sell off a little bit of coal. Let's sell off some oranges. Don't want to touch our tools. Let's grab, oh, definitely some fish. That's what our main trade is going to be. Uh, let's sell off the leather. Oh, we're out of, so there's a dollar limit. So we're at our dollar limit. 689 coins. Let's take that. I'm going to let that turn into a wild card. I don't, okay, don't show that again. So we have a wild card and we have a card. Let's look at the card. Pig Ranch, Fruit Gatherer, Trading Post we have, but sell food which we're already selling food, Mushroom Farm. I'm going to take the free spin, which didn't help us. Farm Mushrooms using wood. I don't want to use our wood. I don't want to, char we don't need a charcoal burner. Uh, let's grab another quarry. And then we can sell stone. Mine, yeah, okay. So let's see if we can't get you in here. Uh, I can, I can mine stone right here. All right, so let's mine some more stone. We can sell some stone. Uh, all right, we're gonna let's connect a path there, and then I think we might want to take this over and connect up somewhere over there. Okay, so we have people without houses, but we have houses being built. 
So again, we're building two, there we go. So now we have, okay, so you, we don't have nobody homeless. Let's upgrade, take the upgrade on that. As soon as this one's built, we're gonna build two more houses. You're upgraded. You're upgraded. I have a wild card. <clears throat> what are our chances of getting that pottery? Now, the next Providence. You're 570. We can actually buy that one now. And that's going to give us tulips. So we can farm tulips over there. We could probably trade the tulips. I'm going to think about that. That's 570. Uh, we have another card. What are our chances of getting hunting lodge, which may come in handy? I could take another fishing lodge. Steel dollars equal to target player's population. Okay, so I think that's steel from our competitor. Or another tribe. We're not going to touch that. Do I want to... F let's do it. And still no clay. Let's take the fishing lodge. Let's show the tech tree. Okay, pottery. We have to unlock it. So we're going to unlock pottery next. I'm going to wait. I'm going to hold on to our wild card until we're done researching pottery. Unlock furniture workshop. Costs us 100 coins. I'm going to take it. That's going to give us a furniture, which we can use to upgrade our houses, I believe. Beer, cannabis, furniture. So furniture will be a luxury to upgrade our town. Perfect. Can I fit another fishing lodge in? I can. And that's as, as much fishing ice I can get unless we buy another part of the coast. Let's throw you in. Let's hook you in with a path. And I think I want to bring a path straight out. But I'm going to hold off yet. Uh, Rowan has upgraded to level 2, whatever that is. We can trade. Uh, where are we on houses? Population 45, house space 48. Take the upgrade on that one. And now let's throw in a couple more houses. Uh, hold on. Let's Before we do that, let's grab a path. Let's bring a path along here. And then let's look and see if I can put a house over here or do they not want to... So, okay, it's 100% appeal. So we can throw in a house. Let's throw in... It's 100% appeal. Let's grab a house. Hold on. What are you? thought I saw something there. I don't know what that is. Let's throw in a house there. I don't know what that is. I saw something hiding in the trees back here. Let's take out the non-fruit trees there. I, there's something back there. I don't know what it is. And then I do want to throw in another house, though. So let's throw in an. I, I don't know what that is. I don't want. I don't want to destroy it. Let's throw another house next to it. 100% appeal, which is fine. Now we want to seriously want to think about doing more farming. Because we don't have a lot of wheat. I want to keep the wheat up. I want to keep the herbs up. Uh, furniture workshop is going to be great. House is too far. 
Okay, so I'm going to need another house over here. All right, so let's throw in a couple houses down here. Or they're not going to be able to work. So let's throw in a house there. And let's throw in another. Oh, so there's no fertile soil there. Uh, so let's throw in another farm here. Uh, let's set it to wheat. And let's see if we can't do one more farm and then we'll do some more herbs. So let's set you to herbal medicine. All right, so auto save. All right, so we're gonna now furniture. Once this this house is built, furniture workshop. And I'm gonna need another forester. So as soon as we buy this Providence, I'm gonna throw in our another forester, and I think I'm gonna throw for, forester and furniture over there. We can trade, which will get us more coins. Uh, so let's sell off some stone. Let's sell off some medicine. Uh, let's go a little bit of coal. Uh, a little bit of fish. And leather gets us another $700, which now we can unlock this Providence. Found tulip seeds. So now we can do tulips as well. Uh, I need 300 coins for a bridge. Uh, what are you? Your birch, hold on. This Providence thousand dollars that's our next target but let's zoom in here a little bit let's throw in the bridge we have the coins come straight across from this path so bridge there let's connect it there and I don't have a lot of room over here but let's do Let's do our Forester. And let's push him out as far as I can to the edge of our property. Actually, no, let's bring over a path first. Yeah, let's bring the path over all the way to the edge of our property. Now let's throw the Forester in as far as I can get him. Let's set him to do non-fruit trees, non-fruit trees. And then let's grab our furniture workshop. Let's rotate it. We'll put it right here, edge of our property, and let's throw some storage in. Throw some storage in there. Oh, I didn't want the wild card. Crap. And let's grab a little bit of storage and let's throw it next to this guy as well. Waiting for pottery to be unlocked. We need pottery to upgrade our houses. Tulip seeds. So let's put a tulip farmer. So we unlocked the tulip seeds. Perfect. Let's grab, what do we want? 20%, let's take the productivity book. Uh, let's throw the productivity book into another fishing. You already have something. You don't have something, so throw you in there. Get more productivity out of that fishing. And then, could we do, let's click on this guy. Probably not over there. Let's try throwing a farm in over here and see if we can't farm tulips. 
uh, let's go here. And now let's see if we can't do... Oh, come on, give me the farm. There's the farm. Yeah, tulips. Let's do tulips there, and hopefully we can trade them. And then let's, next housing we're going to put over there. Yeah, we desperately need more housing. Is the housing down here built? The house, housing down here is still being... Storage is too far. All right, so that's going to be a problem. Let's throw in some storage there. And let's throw in a little bit more storage next to it. So we have a house here going up. Only one. Well, let's throw another house over here. Uh, let's come down this way. Appeal's only 90%. There we go. Let's throw a house there. I'm going to let this one turn into another wild card because I'm waiting for pottery. I'm going to grab a sip of coffee. What the heck is this? Okay, population 52. Uh, Alright, we're almost getting our trade. Yeah, so next... Alright, so what just completed? Alright, so that cool. That's being built. Uh, let's upgrade you. Let's upgrade you. Population 52, house is 56. <clears throat> we got a couple more houses going in. Now, if I want to do more fishing, we're going to have to buy this Providence, which is $2,200. But I want to go up here. That's my next target. So $2,100 is our next target. So one iron ore so we can start doing steel tools. So that's going to be our next target. Can we trade yet? We can. Uh, cool, so we have pottery now. Perfect. Let's just finish out the Dark Age. Let's go with brewing. Do I want to buy the potter for 120? Yes, I want to buy the potter. And let's take the clay pit. Perfect. So now we can start upgrading our houses. We're going to finish. We got to see where we're going to we're going to put them. Let's look at our trade. We have a bunch of stone, so let's go 70 stone. We got a bunch of oranges. Let's go 50 oranges. Let's go fish. And that's going to max out our trade. So that gets us up that gets us half, almost half. Okay, so we're saving up for that region. All right, so where do we want to put our clay production? I don't want to encroach on this forest or any further. I'm wonder, oh, wondering if we can... Oh, our clay has to be on a river. Crap. I think. Uh, let's go clay pit. Requires... Produces clay used to make pottery or brick. Must be next to a river. All right. So we're going to put our clay production up here in this little corner. Alright, so you're going to go there. Let's look at a path. Let's come straight down. That'll hook you in. And now let's look at our potter. Throw our potter next to... Oh, it's going to make that house unhappy. It's going to make that house unhappy. But I can throw it down here. 
let's throw it there. All right, we have a wild card, which I'm not going to touch. And this is going to turn into another wild card. Um, what do we need for our town hall upgrade? It's the next age, which we don't have researched yet. All right, so you're built. Let's upgrade you. Um, you're upgraded as far as I can. You're upgraded as far as I can. So we're waiting on our next house. You, I can upgrade. You're the furniture workshop. You're still being built. We have... Uh, ha uh, yeah, I'm definitely waiting for this. We're definitely saving up for that. The four, This one. This gets us die. Hmm. No, we're going up here next. And then we're going to take more coasts so I can do more fishing. So we're going to either going to go there or we're going to go here. One of the two after this one. Can I get, I can get one more fishing lodge in. We're going to take another fishing lodge. I can put it up here. So we have two wild cards. Can I do fishing? Furniture have, trading I don't need. Mushroom uses wood. Fruit gatherer I don't quite need yet. Let's take the free turn. Doesn't get me anything I need. We could put another tavern in. Let's cancel that. Let's just let it sit there. We have two wild cards. I probably think I'm going to take one more wild card for fishing. We have enough houses for now. Oh, I don't want to spend any coins on the fishing lodge yet, so let's just let that sit there. So we have another immigrant in. Uh, we're going to need to think about a couple more houses. I can do another trade. Let's throw in just the future proof. Let's throw in, let's throw a house in here. And then let's throw a house in. I'll build a path. Let's throw a house in there. And let's grab a path. And let's hook you in there. And there. Uh, let's take the trade since it's available. Uh, let's definitely max out our fish. Let's go like a hundred and twenty fish. Let's sell off some coal. Uh, and then we'll max it out with leather up to 180. So another $600. Quest complete traded, 10,000 coin. We get a company's act as a reward card. What does that do? Minus 10% trade for trading. Where can I put it? Can I put it in the trade or does it have to go into the town hall? has to go into the town hall. All right, cool. So we'll spend less money on trades now. $1,700. We're almost there to get that Providence. So we'll just wait. I think I want to get another trading company. So we can trade. We can double our trades. So after we unlock this territory, I'm going to do another trader and another fishing lodge. We're not making, is our clay stuff done? Not enough input. 
not enough resources to input to keep this building running. So I probably need another clay pit. Upgrade hundred and ninety five dollars. We can upgrade that with another worker. I don't want to do that yet. Are we let's take a look at our statistics. We're short on people. So that's why we have stuff not running. Okay. Alright, so we're now we just need to wait for more people to come in. So you're running when you can. Oh, I could take the upgrade with stone, so let's do that. And this one needs coins for the upgrade, so I can upgrade that. I can't wait for this trade to complete. We definitely need, we desperately need more people. I'm thinking about grabbing another immigration office so we can bring more people in. People in more often. Uh, let's take the trade. Oh yeah, we have a ton of medicine. Let's take the fish first. No, we don't have a lot of it. Let's take the medicine. Uh, let's take some stone. Uh, let's take a little bit of coal. Let's max it out. There we go. Another $700. Yeah, so we have 2,500 coin. So I want to unlock that providence. Um, do I have the money? Let's can I zoom in? No. Okay, so we have 400 coins. Let's take the iron mine. Let's throw the iron mine in. Um, I guess here. Let's put it close. Uh, let's. Okay, so let's show the tech tree. So let's take the sheep ranch next. Uh, beer brewing for 140. Ooh. Uh, yeah, let's turn our wheat into beer. That's going to help our houses level up. Let's build a path for this guy. Can we come straight down? I can. Actually, I want to come over this way and then come down. So I want to put in some more storage. There. Um, beer brewing. It's going to use our wheat. I'm going to let this one turn into another wild card. Um, I'm gonna look at let's look at our houses really quick. Population 64 houses, so we're gonna need another house. So let's put in some housing up here as well. So let's build two more houses. Okay, the appeal is only 80 percent, so we're gonna have to put our houses out towards this way. All right, so hold on before we put our house and let's throw in another path coming up this way. Let's throw in at least two more houses. Heals 100%. Let's throw a house in there. Let's throw a house in. Let's leave a space for a path. You're only 88% appeal. Why? If I rotate you this way. Oh, let's throw you there. That's going to get us two more houses. Let's upgrade that one. Oh, that was the hunting lodge. That's all right. Um, you're waiting on a hearth before you can upgrade. You have the stone upgrade. You have the stone upgrade. What do we have down here? You have the stone upgrade. Let's take the stone upgrade on that one. 
Uh, let's take a quick peek at our statistics. We're still way short on people. I'm going to hold off on beer brewing. I'm actually going to use one of our wild cards and I'm going to see if we can do another immigration office. I can. I'm going to take that. Let's put it next to this one. We can get people in a lot quicker. So let's throw that in. That should double our people that's coming in. I don't want to put beer brewing down because we don't have enough people to, for the jobs that we currently have. So we desperately need more people. And I may even buy another immigration office with our last wild card. Yeah, I'm going to let that turn into a wild card and we're going to buy another immigration office. Alright, you should be making... Oh, it's turning it into pottery. It's not turning it into what we need to upgrade our houses. What do we need to... Up Can I switch this? I can't. You're making pottery. How do I get... Do I need to demolish... You're making clay. What do I need to upgrade my houses? We need brick. Where do I make brick? A hearth fireplace. Let's look at our wild card. Do we have a hearth fireplace? I don't. Agriculture, industry, services, and other. Where do I get a hearth fireplace so I can start making... Upgrade... Cost... Th oh, 30 brick. Where do I get brick? The charcoal burner? Do you make brick? Turns wood into coal, beer, pottery, or brick. How do I change you to brick? How do I change you the potter to brick? Middle Ages. Ah, okay. So, requires the Middle Age, I think, to make brick. Let's look at our research. Brickworks. Okay, so we have to go Middle Age to unlock brickworks. So, after the Sheep Ranch, we're, gonna, we're just going to finish out the Dark Ages, and then the first thing we're going to go for is brickworks. Alright, so, did we build any more houses? that I can upgrade this one. Let's upgrade that one. We have 152 coins. Let's do another trade. We have a ton of stone. Uh, let's sell off a little bit of medicine. Definitely leather. It's going to get us another 797 coins. I don't want to put the beer brewing down until we get more people in because we still have... Do we finally have all of our jobs filled? We finally have all of our jobs filled. Alright, now let's put down the brewery. Which we're going to tear in our wheat. Because if we look here... To um, for our luxury tier, we need beer, cannabis, furniture, pottery, which we're making, and tulips, which we're making. 
but they don't have any. I Yeah, we definitely definitely need the brick. Let's take this one that's just to finish out Dark Ages, and then we'll go to the potter. Buy a sheep ranch for a hundred coins. Let's take it. We have a couple wild cards. Why are you spinning? Okay, because now my houses are automatically upgrading. Oh, nice. So now the house is automatically upgrade after I upgrade them the first time. Sweet. Um, you, let's take you. And are you, and let's take that upgrade. Population 65 housing. Okay, so I don't need any houses for a little while. Um, so sheep ranch. I wish it told me how many free laborers I had. I have. I would love to see one more statistic that shows me my free people. Like how many extra laborers I'm not using. Buildings. Population is only... So it doesn't show me available workers. I would love to see available workers. Employed 47 out of 47. Okay, so we don't have any more free people. But we have two immigration offices now. We definitely want beer brewing so our houses keep upgrading. Oh, so that one went to level three. Perfect. So that gives us, I think it gives us more people. Oh no, they're more efficient and, and occupancy, both. Okay, and we get more income and we get more science. Okay, we definitely want to focus on upgrading our houses. So beer brewing is going to be the priority. Do we have any more free laborers? I don't. I think we're going to take another trade office. Let's sell off, since we're using fish for trading, let's sell off the fish. We're not using leather, so let's sell off the leather. So that's another $700. Um, all right, so which pro let me zoom out here a little bit. So which providence do we want next? 1800. Do we want to go up the coast or do we want to go down the coast? I definitely want to do more fishing. That doesn't give me much coast. This one does. I think we're going to take this one and then this one and then we're going to backfill into that one. And then we'll come up here. So I think that's the order we're going to go in. Here, 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 and then here. So $2,200. going to try not to spend any coins. Um, we are definitely going to buy another trader with our card. We got two wild cards. We have no free laborers but I, I definitely want to get our beer let's throw our beer brewing in and see what happens uh, we have room up here uh, let's look at our pathing so let's take our pathing let's take this guy straight up uh, let's throw our brewery in here somewhere that's going to make that house angry. Let's throw... Um, one square short. I want to save room along the river in case I need to put more potters in. 
Uh, where can I throw our brewery in where it's not going to make anybody mad? I'm going to put another trade office there. Uh, I want to leave room here for a couple more miners. Okay, we're going to have to go up this way. And I'm going to push it out where it doesn't make anybody mad. Let's throw that there. Let that build. We have enough housing, so I'm not going to put any more housing in for now. I really wish I knew how many free people I had. Let's let the brewery build before we can take another trade. Uh, again, let's sell off some fish. Uh, let's sell off some stone. Uh, let's sell off... a little bit of coal just to bring it up to 180. And we'll just go... We'll take the rest of the stones. Take it up to 180. Let's take the trade. Another $700. Alright, so we are now done with <clears throat> the Dark Age. Um, we have to unlock the Middle Age first, so let's unlock the Middle Age next. And then we'll take the Potter. Let that turn into a wild card. Um, didn't want to click on that. Let's see what happens once this builds. Now we want to start thinking about bringing in more wood, more coal. Our basic, now that we're expanding with all these houses, we're going to have to start bringing more of the basics in. Our houses are automatically upgrading. That is awesome. Let's go down here. Let's so you're upgraded, you're upgraded, you're upgraded. Don't need any more houses yet. We're gonna bring in some more immigrants here in a minute. Wait for this to build so I can see what happens to our worker population. And then we're gonna need to throw in a couple more miners. We're gonna have to start bringing in some more stone and some more coal and some more iron. So I think that's what we're going to use our wild cards on. Storage, where are we on storage? Slot you, okay, so we're good on storage yet. We have $2,600. How much was this next Providence? We can actually buy this. How much will that leave us? That'll leave us a couple hundred dollars. Let's take it. And then we can do more fishing. We're almost ready to trade again, but I don't. we're running low on a lot of stuff, so I'm going to let the trade sit there a minute. You are 14 to 15 animals, 15 to 15 animals. So you're going to start butchering. So now we're going to have some more meat coming in. We're good on food. Uh, well done. First house went up to level four. Do we want to trade? What can I trade? Yeah, we can. Let's take the fish. Since that's what our, primor our priority right now, let's take a little bit of herbs just to bring it up to one, close to 180. Uh, and let's do the leather. That'll take us up to 180. 
another 600 coins. Uh, so 1500 that's going to be our target houses are automatically upgrading so we have we're going to need to throw a couple more houses in let's throw a couple more houses over here let's look at our pathing uh, let's bring this straight down and then let's throw in I'm going to hold down shift. I'm going to throw in a couple more houses. Let's throw in a house. 100%. Throw two more houses in right there. Um, we're brewing beer. So that's going to help our houses upgrade. Employed 46 out of 50. Perfect. So that's what I was looking for. So we have people not doing anything. So now let's take our sheep farm. Since we're expanding down this way, let's see if we can throw our sheep farm in. Do I want to throw it here? Or do I want to wait until we buy that territory? Uh... Do I want to take it all? Where do I want to put this? It's going to make our houses. Let's hold off on that until we buy the next territory. Which we only need about $500. The houses upgrading really help. I want to bring a path straight back and then we're going to see what happens when we buy this territory. We have three wild cards. I'm going to hold off on them. Uh, let's take... Trade's almost ready. What do we need for this problem? We need about... $400. Uh, let's sell off. Where's our leather? Let's take all of our leather. We're not using it. Let's take 80 leather. Um, let's sell off. Yeah, let's sell off some of our medicine. Perfect. And let's take that. It's going to get us another $700. Perfect. So now we can buy this Providence. We found die seeds. Let's accept them into the city. Uh, let's take the passion. Now we can do our pig farm. And we found die. So let's see, let's see how the die works. Let's go to one of our fishing. You don't have a card. Let's throw you in there. Let's take the die seeds so we're going to do a pig farm the sheep farm over here and let's figure out what we need to do for die let's grab a path coming straight back let's just take it straight back to the end of our territory Let's grab, now we can grab the sheep farm. Let's throw the sheep farm in back here. We're going to have to put some more houses in. Let's throw that in. Welcome to the Middle Ages. Many of your buildings can now be upgraded to the new error. Which bonus do we want? Ten, plus 10% 10 farm productivity within the granaries radius. Mines deplete. Yeah, let's take the less mine depletion. 15% um, popularity when producing beer, vodka, and wine. 20%. I'm going to take this one. I know about wild cards. Um, we're definitely, we desperately need more house. So we're going to get more housing down and over here. And then I want to see about the die. Can I... I'm going to throw a farm in just to see if I can take 
to die. If not, well, we need more food anyway. Uh, too large. Right there. So let's throw you in. Yeah, we could do die. Let's take the die. I don't know what the die does, but let's make you die. Let's throw in a path coming up this way. Just for the heck of it. Let's throw in some storage. Uh, hold on, where's our pathing? Our pathing is right there. So let's throw in some storage here. And then let's throw in, yeah, we desperately need more houses. So let's build, what's the appeal? So they don't, they don't want to be near the pig farm. I'm going to hold down shift. Let's throw in oh, auto save. Come on, stop. Let's throw in two more houses for now. Let's upgrade that one. All right, where are we? Where's my statistics bureau? Not that one. 50 of 50, so we're using all of our people. We have three wild cards. All right, what do we need to upgrade? $2,000 to upgrade the town hall. I think that's what our priority needs to be. Yeah, we need that one more house. Population 99, housing space 103. Yeah, we definitely need the housing. We can trade. Uh, let's let this build out. Let's take that upgrade. And then we want to think about brick. Uh, what are we working on? Am I not working on anything? We're not. Let's take brickworks. And then we're going to take a library probably next. Upgrade trees. Oh, this is the upgrade. This one, I can't research both. I think you can do one or the other. We may want to take cabbage seeds. But let's see what happens once that one's done. All right, 100 people. Let's take, consumes 40% less input. Decreases upkeep by, let's take the productivity. We have a thousand dollars. What's our next providence? 2100 for the next providence. We have, wrong one. So we're employing 48 of 50. So we are short people. So I can't put any, I don't want to put any more buildings in. You have, let's throw the productivity in there. And oh yeah, we def, okay, I know what we need to improve next. We have to definitely improve our, we need, we're going to need more stone, more iron, and more coal. Because as we build more houses, they're going to consume more of that product. Let me take a quick peek at the time. 11 o'clock. All right, I'm going to go probably only about another half an hour and then get out of here. So we have three wild cards. So I want to, okay, so there's not enough input. Why do you not have enough input? Are you out of product? No, there's resources left. Hold on, you're not enough input. We don't have enough wheat, so we're gonna need another wheat farm. Where's our, um, show the tech tree. 
or show the upgrade tree. Let's let's look at the upgrade tree. Let's take unlocks What's this homebrew do? I don't know. Let's take the homebrew. Do I want to buy Brickworks for $620? We definitely want Brickworks because that's going to upgrade our houses. Um, wheat. All right, so wheat needs so no, we need another wheat farm as well. Let's work on the wheat farm first. So let's bring you straight up. Um, so let's look at farming. Ooh, there's not a lot of fertile ground up that way. Uh, let's throw another wheat farm in over here. Um, so that'll get us more wheat for the beer. And let's get the brickworks going. Which is not going to make our people happy. So this needs to be put away from some homes. Uh, might be able to put it back here and just build a path out to it. Let's throw it there. Let's grab a dirt road and let's bring a dirt road. We don't have any roads. Let's come down here. No, can we go through there? I can't. Let's come through here and we'll go straight over. And then let's throw down some storage and oh yeah we have enough storage all right let you turn into a wild card where are we on so 50 employed of 52 50 of 52 so we still have do we still yeah so we have so we have nobody working yet all right so we're still short on labor so we may want I may take another immigration office we have eight hundred dollars let's take a trade uh, let's take our leather since we're not using it Uh, so let's take the leather. Uh, let's take some stone. It's going to give us another $700. So we're up to $1,600. Now, before I take another Providence, show the tech tree or show the upgrade tree. Let's look at the upgrade tree first. Oh, so we got to do this three times. You know what? Show me the tech tree. Let's take iron working so we can start making iron tools. You received a homebrew card from the upgrade tree. Oh, so the homebrew car, I get it now. So they, where's our brewery? Here's our brewery. Okay, so where do you have to go? You have to go into the town hall. Uh, we don't have room to put another card in here until we upgrade it. All right, so that's going to need to be our next priority, is upgrading the town hall. Let's take... Um, services? No, industry. Let's take a coal mine. Where's our coal? I guess we could put another coal mine here. Oh, let's put it here. Let's throw it there and let's grab a path. Crap, I can't hook in anywhere. Can I? Oh, yeah, I can. So that's going to get us more coal. Stone. We got two stone miners. 
let's take <coughs> let's take an iron mine. Uh, let's take the iron mine. Let's throw in here. And now let's take our pathing and let's hook our iron mine in. And then do I have room to put more storage down? I do. That's going to help us with our iron tools. So we have two iron mines, two coal mines, two stone mines. Uh, logs. Definitely need another forester. Let's take the trade. Um, I'm going to go iron, bunch of iron ore, I don't care. I'm just going to go all iron ore. So that gets us, now we, let's upgrade the town hall. So let's throw the card in there. Research away to the next air and lock the town hall upgrade. Your town hall is now level 3, plus 10% mine quarry production. It gives us immigrants, cards, and kidnap. <laughs> I don't even want to know what kidnap is. Unlock the ability to set delivery target. You can set the storage market where the building's output will be stored. Click the productivity building to bring up the panel. Click set delivery target and select target which you want to deliver. Alright, so Town Hall's upgraded as far as we can go, which is going to start upgrading more houses. You need a hearth. You can take that upgrade. You could take that upgrade. Where did we build more houses? So they're upgraded as far as I can go. They're upgraded as far as we can go. Ooh, we need more houses. Uh, we desperately need more houses. All right, housing. Let's rotate you. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Let's rotate you. Let's put in, let me hold down shift. Let's go one, two more houses there. All right, let's show the tech tree. Uh, that's a bonus. Taylor, we can start turning our leather into Taylor. Let's take, oh, I want the blacksmith. Buy the iron smelter for 600 coins. That's going to take every penny we have. No, let's not do that yet. Well, I definitely want to start making tools, so that's going to be our next priority up here is tool production. Oh, Forester. Oh my goodness, we need more wood. Uh, we're going to take it. Let's take a Forester. Uh, let's throw another Forester up here. Uh, let's take him up as far out as I can go to the edge of our territory. Let's throw him up there. Let's cut and plant. Let's go non-fruit trees, non-fruit trees. And let's take a path and let's hook him in there. And there's probably not going to be houses close, so let's just do it. Let's grab a couple more houses. Let's throw a house here. And let's throw another house. There. And then we're going to have to cut some wood down because we are definitely out of wood until we get... Alright, so let's cut non-fruit trees from here. Until that forester is up and running. We are out of wood. Oh, 
wow, food went to crap in a, let's buy, we definitely need to, we have to buy some food. Let's buy, uh, let's offset it with iron. All right, hold on. How does that work? Okay, let's take this up. What is this? Is it the other way to buy? How do I buy food? I don't have. I can't buy food. We didn't buy the card to buy food. Crap. I can't buy food. Can I buy food? I need the card in order to buy food. All right, we're going to have to get more food going really, really quick. Or we're going to be screwed. So let's buy, we have a wild card. Let's buy another, let's get another hunter. And let's throw him up here by this forester. Yeah, let's throw him up here by this forester. And that'll get us a little bit more food coming in. That's our last wild card. I'm going to let this go to another... I can take four items. Let's get a little bit more cash coming in. And now we're going to have to figure out how to buy food. Gets us another seven hundred dollars. How do we buy food? We we're working on building some houses. So we got two houses coming in up down here. We got a couple houses coming in up here. We need another farm. So we definitely we desperately need more food. Uh, let's throw in a farm. Is that a path? Hold on, before I throw the farm in. Yeah, you're a path coming all the way out. So let's take you to the edge of our property. And let's throw in another farm here. And we'll set you, you could be wheat. And then where does that put our 48 of 66? So we're, we need more people. I'm going to let this go to a wild card. We're going to buy another immigration office. Those farms are not going to help us until... So sheep... I want to, let's buy a couple animals. I know it's taking our money, but let's get it up to 15 so they can start butchering. So they're going to start butchering. We'll get more food there. Pigs are butchering. We have... Food is, oh, we are going to have gifted you $100 for good relations. <laughs> we desperately need food. Let's get, all right, crap. That's going to turn into a wild card. Can we do, I want another, crap. Every time I pass, it gives a card away. Buy a wild card. I can buy another wild card. I want the fishing lodge. Let's take the fishing lodge. Perfect. Let's take our fishing lodge. We desperately need food. And let's throw a fishing lodge there. Um, close you for now. No, we'll 
buy a blacksmith card for three hundred dollars. Ooh, let's take it. Tool count is low. I know. I'm desperately running out of everything. We're growing too much. Let's hook you into here. Uh, yeah, let's hook you into there. All right. So tools. Crap. Tools have to be our priority. Food and tools. Uh, let's get another fishing lodge. Let's throw it here. Uh, let's hook it in. To there. That's going to get us more fish coming in. Wish I knew how to I can buy food. I can't buy food yet. I don't have that card. Oh wait, is this going to give us plus 60 food? And it's going to cost me $400. I think I can buy food this way. I can buy fish. Let's get as much fish as I can. Let's trade iron ore to offset the fish. Let's see what that. Let's see what happens there. Not enough money for the trade. Ah, uh, I can't. I only have two hundred dollars. No cannibalism. We're, we got people dying because I have no food. And we're desperately going to need some tools. I let food get ahead of me, which I play Banish and I never let food get ahead of me. Uh, the problem is we don't have enough people I don't want to bring any more people in we just got to build those two fisheries and I think I sold my fish instead of buying fish I'm thinking we need another farm. Oh, we got a bunch of people dying of starvation. We, we're going to be out of tools and we're going to be out of food. I don't have any more room to put any more fishing in. Uh, maybe down here. No, I don't have... Maybe down here. Let's take our wild card. Let's buy another fishery. I'm going to have to, oh crap, I need a bridge. Let's go this way. Let's put you there. Let's hook this one in with a path. And hopefully by putting all these uh, fisheries in, it'll, we can recover on our food. Tools. We are now out of tools. Crap. Alright. Blacksmith. Let's get you in there. What are you going to make? I don't know what you're going to make. Oh, okay.
I'm hoping that'll make tools. Um, let's just look at this really quick. Hunting Lodge Tavern, Blacksmith. Forges tools from iron bars and wood. Okay, so the blacksmith, is that what we just put down? Yes, yeah, so that's what we just put down. Perfect. It's just got to get built. Alright, so you are now fishing. So we get two more fishing. Food is starting to come back. Um, let's take the upgrade here. Let's take the upgrade there. And then I thought I built some houses up here. Take that upgrade that upgrade. Alright, come on, you just need to be built. Food is starting to come back. A um, couple more farms, but we don't have the population. Um, can't put a farm in now because it's not going to grow because we've missed this growing season. Animal farms are going to have to be our priority. Animal farms and fishing are our priority right now. Um, what can we trade? Let's, we're going to need cash, so let's sell off uh, do we have any leather? Sell off the leather. And then we'll sell off some iron. And some stone. Gets us another $700. Food. I... Do I want a wild card or do I want to take my chances? Hunting Lodge. Hunting Lodge will bring more food in. Let's take the Hunting Lodge for 40. Let's take another Sheep Ranch. Um, let's take the Mushroom far Farm because I desperately need food. Where can we go? Uh, so let's look at this area down here. Let's go Mushroom Farm. Let's throw it in here. Let's leave room. Let's leave three spaces. One space for a path. A couple spaces for storage. Mushroom Farm is going to get us some food. Hunting Lodge. Let's throw a Hunting Lodge down here. Edge of our territory. That's probably a bad place. Let's go up here. And let's see about throwing in another Hunting Lodge. We already have one up here. Let's go to the edge of our territory. Let's throw in. That's not going to help us. That's going to overlap our hunting lodges too much. I'm going to have to go down here. All right, hunting lodge. Let's throw in a hunting lodge here. I know, I know everything is getting low. So that's going to get us a little bit more food. Sheep, another sheep ranch is going to get us more food. You're going to, come on, you need to be built so we can get tools. Are we out of iron? I'm going to have to take the upgrade. Uh, I'm 
going to have to take the upgrade. Can I trade? Yeah, let's get rid of some more iron. Oh, we need the smelter. That's what our problem is. We've got to turn our ore. We need the smelter. So you're not going to do us any good without the smelter because you're going to need iron bars. We're making ore. We need a smelter. Wild card. I'm taking the wild card. Do we have a smelter? So the blacksmith tools from iron bars. The brick works makes brick. Which makes Coal mine, fruit gatherer. Let's go to industry. Iron smelter, 600. Let's. We're gonna have to do it. These two need to be the priority. Food and tools. Can I trade for crap? I should have traded for tools. Let's wait for the trader to come up. Can I get another trader? I can buy wood. I don't want to buy wood. Iron smelter, crap. Let's take the free. Sell food. Yes. Or do I want the wild card? Ooh, give me the wild card. And I can sell food. Oh, no, no, no. I want another trader. So I want to be able to buy twice as much and sell twice as much. I think I want another trader. I'm going to hold off. I want to see if I can buy tools. Food and tools are our priority right now. Come on. Let's see if I can buy tools. Trade. All right, can I buy tools? Oh, you mean I cannot buy tools? Are you kidding me? Dye fish, leather, clay. Crap, I can't buy tools. What the hell? good as a trader if I can't buy tools. Steel tools. Can I buy tools? I can. Can I offset it with a sale? So if I come back up top, can I sell? Yeah, I can. Can I get a couple more tools? Not enough money. Crap. Alright, that's going to get me some tools. That's going to get me a little bit of tools anyway. They all went out really quick. Food is starting to come back up. Black
Jeff Smith isn't doing anything. Okay, these two are not. These two really need to get built. Alright, cool. Alright, we're starting to recover on food. I desperately need tools. You two just need to get built. We need to start smelting iron and turning it into tools. Uh, we only have $300. I'm going to let this card sit there a minute. I don't know what these little stars mean now. Oh, because they're not, there's no people in the... Yeah, our, some of our farms have no people, maybe? No? 75 of 79. Come on, where's my... As soon as I get another trade, we're going to buy some more tools. I want to get the sheep ranch down as well. Somewhere in here. I want to get another sheep ranch in. And that'll get us more food as well. Tools are a priority though first. Um, our main focus is going to be buying more food sheep and pig farms. Come on, these two just need to build. You need iron bars, so we're waiting for this to construct, and you need... What do you need? Nothing. Come on, you just need to build. It has... We're just waiting for more stone. So we're just waiting for stone to get delivered so we, that can build. Where's our trader? Let's trade. Can I get more tools? I don't care if they're stone tools. Can I offset that with... Let's take the wool. Not enough money. Crap. Uh, that should get us a couple more tools. Alright, so we now have a few spare tools. So everybody should grab a tool now. Food is still a pr problem. Let's get the sheep farm down. downgrading because it doesn't like to be near all right let's spin you can i get you in here i can't all right we're gonna have to go up here with the sheep farm i think all right let's come up here with the sheep farm storage is too far all right let's can i not get a sheep farm in anywhere must be inside of our territory. Let's spin you this way. Let's throw in, let's get you down as far as I can go. Let's throw in a sheep farm there. Uh, let's bring a road down this way. That'll take care of Now we're going to need some storage. Storage is too far. So let's throw in some storage. Here. 
and then we'll throw in some storage there crap and now let's look at our tech tree because we're not doing any research let's take the library uh, logistics one take the agriculture oh wait we have let's take the potato seeds we had a ton let's take the logistics let's take the tailor um, let's look at our this guy so let's take cabbage seed let's do cabbage seeds buy library card for sixty dollars Right, show the upgrade tree. That went quick. Let's take what is the beer tag? Let's go to the other one. Uh, let's go uh, take the bakery. Do I want to buy the granary card for? I don't have. I don't have the money. Potato seeds, hauling services. 60 points. Let's take it. I don't know what it does. I can't do the tailor. Cabbage seeds. You are... We desperately need some farms. We desperately need another territory. So we can get a ton of farms in. Alright, we have... We have enough houses. we don't have enough labor potato seeds we can grow potatoes cabbage seeds we can grow cabbages I don't know what the hauling services does but let's throw it down and we'll see what that does you are now making iron bars perfect I can't upgrade it with anything because we're not doing bricks I thought we bought the brickworks not enough input alright so we need another clay pit we desperately need another clay pit we have a wild card oh, what, what are our ch let's go here let's take Let's take a wild card. Let's take the clay pit. Need money. Five immigrants join upon. Oh, I don't have enough money to buy that one. All right, clay pit. We definitely have to get another clay pit down. Can I put you? It's going to make those people unhappy. It has to be on a river. going to make those people unhappy. Oh, we need a clay pit. Uh, one square short. Alright, we're going to have to throw you up here somewhere. really wanted it down here somewhere. That's going to make people unhappy. That's going to make people unhappy. You're going to have to go up here somewhere. You're going to have to go right there. And let's hook in a path coming straight down. And let's bring you out this way as well. Why are we out of food again? Why 
why are we out of food again? We have anything not upgraded. You need to build so we can... You're waiting on iron bars. You're making iron bars. Do I want to set a priority target and have them go straight into here? Oh, I can't. All right, let's not do that. Food. Medicine. Crap, we're going to start getting sick. All right, do we have, can we throw in another farm for medicine? Uh, yeah, let's go, hold on, let's grab a path first. We'll come straight down to the edge of our property. And now let's go in here, let's throw in another. You are going to be medicinal herbs. You are going to be cabbage. Can we throw in another farm? Oh, I need a bridge across there. Uh, let's throw in right here. Let's do another farm. Let's make you potatoes. Hopefully this will take care of our food situation. Why are you unhappy? All right. Well, medicine. Do I want to buy medicine until... Let's scroll the way back up to the top. Can I buy medicine and offset it. I can. Can I offset the cost with iron? I can. It's going to get us a little bit of medicine. Food is starting to come back. Tools are the priority, and you're not getting built. Why? You have all your goods. That just needs to get built. We can start making tools. Uh, we have enough houses. We have enough storage. Uh, I'm going to let that turn into a wild card. Let me take a quick peek at the time. I'm going to def desperately need to get out of here. 11.46. I'll go in a few more minutes. We'll go to just close to noon, about another 10 minutes, and then I'm going to have to get out of here. All right, so you're being built. So that's going to save our butt with tools. Food is our next priority. Oh, another fruit gatherer up here, I think. Another forester, I think, just doing fruit. We desperately need this Providence. But it's $2,000. You are... 1700 you are a thousand you're 1100 800 that'll get us I can put like a forester hunter-gatherer up there 
900 needs to be our next target. Alright, show the upgrade tree first. Uh, I'm not worried about anything in the upgrade tree. Show me the beekeeper. Yeah, let's do the beekeeper. I'm, I'm sure that'll get us more food. Do I want the windmill? Oh, I don't have the money. That'll get us that'll turn our flower that'll get us flour that'll get us more food crap that's only gonna leave me a hundred dollars let's take the windmill I don't have, I can't buy the baker I'm gonna sit on the windmill it can sit there a minute sell half your city food for five dollars each you can turn into another wild card. We are good on medicine for now. We're good on tools for now. We're good on food for now. Let's cash. Desperately cash. Let's sell. Uh, I guess we're just going to go with all iron. Why are our houses downgrading? Oh, we need more houses. Let's throw some more up here. Oh, we got a mountain there. Eighty-eight percent appeal. Oh, we're going to have to go up this way. All right, hold on. Let's grab a dirt road. Let's go straight up this way. And then let's see if we can't get 100% appeal. Let's throw one. three more houses in and they're all hooked to a path alright right, so what needs to be our priority more medicine so which means another farm another farm for medicine where are we on we're using 98 of 99 we st we're still short on people. Cash is starting to come back. Medicine. T medicine and food. We built a couple more farms, so they're growing. We need more space. We need another Providence. I think thousand dollars we're gonna have to go for that uh, trade All right, we're gonna buy we're gonna sell what we can we're gonna buy another Providence and then I'm gonna get out of here so let's let's sell the leather because we're not turning it into clothes yet That should get us. Yeah, let's take that Providence. I know it's not much, but it's going to get us. Let's use our wild card. Let's do a fruit gatherer. Uh, let's turn it this way. So let's do a fruit gatherer. Uh, let's try 
and get it in our providence as much as I can. Alright, let's do a fruit gatherer there. Let's look at a... Let's bring you straight down. So, fruit gatherer. Um, let's go with... Another hunting lodge. No, I should not have bought that hunting lodge because now they're going to cross each other. Crap. I can't undo. Oh, I can undo. Oh, cool. I can undo the hunting lodge and it didn't cost us a card. No hunting lodge. Uh, let's take... Do I want the bakery? Bakes bread out of the wheat flour. We have the windmill. Let's take the bakery. Let's put the bakery and the windmill down. So let's do... Ooh, we don't have brick. Are we making brick? We're making brick. Let's put that down. Needs to run to convert this wild card into a building. Ooh. Let's do it. And let's throw the windmill down next to it. And then let's grab some wheat farm right here. And that's going to do a whole production chain there for bread. We need more houses. Where did I put houses in? They're not built yet. All right. Food is starting to recover. Medicine is starting to recover. Tools. We, we're going to have to double our tool production. So our next two cards are going to be another smelter. All right, they're not built yet. So we need another, where are they? Here, we need another iron smelter and another blacksmith. So iron smelter and blacksmith are gonna have to be our next priority. We are, we are really short on people. I, I'm going to leave it here, so let's save the game. Um, can I name it? I will just save it. And I'm going to exit to the desktop. I'm going to get out of here. Appreciate everybody stopping in saying hello throw y'all one ending soon. Um, hope everybody has a great day. I will probably not be on again today.